Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo. Happy Sunday. Welcome back today to episode 26 of the Minecraft Pocket Edition Realms SMP series. This is the series with the other YouTubers. Now if you guys watched my live stream the other day, we actually finally built ourselves an animal shelter. Now if you did miss it, do not worry, you can check out the live stream in description. Before the live stream, we actually did a bonus episode. Now we're gonna be adding three people to the subscriber wall because you guys helped me out a bunch in the comment section. Um, we found out the prices of Brandon's saddles. Now in today's episode, we're actually gonna focus on getting ourselves some animals for the shelter. Um, and somebody suggested, right? I don't know if you guys can come up with a better idea, but somebody came up with a suggestion saying, hey Echo, build a stone store. A lot of people such as Dallas, Jack and stuff, they're all running out of um, stone. So we could introduce like stone, cobblestone, stone brick, and the site, the polished versions, the diorite, the granite. What do you guys think about that? Unless you guys can come up with a better store option, then I think that could be the next build we're gonna be doing. So let's jump straight into this. The other thing I wanna talk about is a lot of you have been asking me, where is my Minecraft Pocket Edition Let's Play series? The Let's Play series will return when 0.16 is released, okay? So just so you guys know about that. So um, I spent a little bit of time, and now in fact, I made myself a Luck of the Seed 3 and Lair 3. Now we bought these books from Jack, okay? We bought them from Jack and we made ourselves a fishing rod because I'll explain to you guys in a second. I kind of don't want to ruin it just yet, but we need to find ourselves a sign because I need to add some of you guys um, to the subscriber wall. Again, it, they, you guys get added every single Sunday. It's a Sunday thing. I don't add you guys every, oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Poop. I want to see if there's a, I want to see if there's a, a sign in here. Do you have any signs in here? Unless the sign's still on the wall. Is there one on the wall? There's not. We need to make ourselves some new ones. Um, so, I should have, so I think I had some signs left over. I did, didn't I? Did I not? Surely I did. Where, where on earth are they? So, no, okay, I guess we're gonna have to make some more. Okay, so let's just take, uh, oh, we do, we got some in here. Okay, let's take all 14 of these. A little bit of an idea here. Let's just put these on the wall so then I don't have to worry about these in the coming episodes. Now, every single Sunday, I add three of you guys to the wall just for helping me out, being helpful, giving me suggestions, letting me know on things I did miss. So let's just quickly put these here real quick. Um, there's a lot more people that are gonna be added. Now, if you are enjoying this series, then be sure to thumbs up because I appreciate all your kind support as well. Six more to go. So one, oops. Uh, oh, what? Did I do two there? Did I do two? I did do two by mistake. Got five more left. One, two, three. Okay, we've got two more to go. Um, we're gonna be putting people on here as well. So one and two. Okay, we can come back to them later on. It just means that I don't have to keep placing uh, signs or looking for signs every single episode. So, who are the lucky people to be added in today's episode? So we did a little bit of research in the comments section. Now the first person we're gonna be adding is gonna be just MK. Now we was having a little bit of an idea, we we're having a little bit of a, a problem in figuring out how Brandon's shop works, okay? So he helped me out a bunch in the comment section. A lot of you did, but he was the first to comment it and it was thumbs up by a lot of you. So thank you so much. The next person is gonna be Lego. Lego dude, and then it's just 144 space 144. I oh, know there was no space 1446. And then he did have MCP, but that's not gonna fit, fit. But he helped me out again. The majority of these helped me out in the comment section. The last person I'm gonna introduce is gonna be Happy Face because Happy Face left some very, very nice comments. And I really appreciate the nice comments. They do help me out a bunch. They keep me going and making more videos. So, there are three people to be added in today's video. Now, again, if you did miss the last episode, which was a live stream, make sure you go and check it out because I'm gonna show you exactly what we spent our time building. It took us like a good hour or so to build. We did do a lot of trial and error, but we built this. Now, I know it doesn't have a roof. That is because I asked you guys, do you think it should have a roof? And you guys said, no, don't let it have a roof. So. This is kind of our animal shelter. So the animals will go inside there. Now a lot of you have been telling me that sheep need grass to grow their wool. We're not gonna be shearing the wool, the, the wool from the sheep. We're just gonna keep them, to, we're gonna breed as many animals as we can. Now in the first couple episodes in this, we did have a few issues. And the issues that we had were animals kept disappearing. So we need to grab ourselves some things such as we're gonna have to grab ourselves some seeds, we're gonna have to grab ourselves some wheat, some carrots to grab the sheep. We need to grab them all, by the way. We need to grab, we're gonna take chickens, pigs, cows, sheep, all of them, as many as we can. Now, as you guys can see, I do have a bunch of fish. I'm gonna explain to you why we have a bunch of fish. So I explained to you before, 
that we bought some books from Jack and they were to do my enchanted fishing rod. The reason why, right? I'm gonna show you guys exactly why right now, okay? I'm gonna show you guys exactly why I have to buy these. Now, a lot of you know that I've always wanted to have my own horse in this series, but you can't get a horse without having a saddle. Now, Brandon does have his own shop, and so does Dallas, by the way. They both sell this one item. I've been looking for a saddle for an extremely long time, and we finally found the prices of Brandon's saddles. Now, I like Brandon, but they are expensive. To me, they are way, way, way too expensive. So, he does say prices aren't final, so we could speak to him, but you guys have told me that you have to, like, hover over them. It's really cool. He used name tags to name the things. Like, for example, you can see here, uh, one diamond equals 10 item frames. So the saddles, 12 diamonds for one saddle. That is so expensive. So, so expensive. Like, really, really, really expensive. So, although I want to buy, I, although I want to saddle, I'm not about to pay that much. That's really expensive. Now, if you guys have been watching Dallas episodes, some of you said that Dallas has saddles as well, by the way. He sold out. He was selling them for 10 diamonds. Um, but a lot of you guys were telling me, that Dallas bought my diamonds. Now, it was a very, very good, smart business move for both of us. So if you did see Dallas' episode, so what happened in Dallas' episode is he bought my emerald. I'm going to show you guys real, 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 real quick. Uh, he bought my my emerald. So what it's, as you guys can see, one ore is one diamond. So he bought the emerald ore, and I told him to use my fortune, and he did. Now, the ore gave him one emerald. So technically he bought one emerald for one diamond. So it's a little bit of a gamble on my stop, my short, my alert, my store, which is why I like it. Now in here, we did have six diamond ores. Dallas bought them all. Now to buy six of them, it's two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve diamonds to buy six ores. Now he he did get I've already taken the, the money out and put it in my chest. He he bought he bought them. And he actually ended up with 15 uh, diamonds. Now, it's a gamble, guys. Remember, it's a gamble. Because he could end up with, like, 10 diamonds. He could end up with 12, 9. But he got 15. So, he actually gained 3 diamonds. And that is why I like the store this way. Because it's really, really smart. Now, we're going to have to grab a few things in here. Um, we will have to stock this up in, in a bonus episode in the coming weeks. But, first thing is first. Let me quickly not take a cookie. Let me grab myself the, these. Because we're going to obviously need some, some chickens. Let's not break these yet. Uh, and I'm going to take the seeds as well because we're going to have to lead the chickens into the, uh, the the area along with the other animals as well. So I see a creeper over there. I'm going to stay away from him before he ends up killing me because creepers are evil. I'm going to sleep and I'm going to grab myself some animals. So we're going to try and grab as many animals as I can. So of course, we're going to be trying to grab cows, sheep, pigs, chickens. So we need some carrots. I need to go and try and find myself some carrots. So that's the plan today's episode. That's the plan. Um, so that's why I made myself a fishing rod. A fishing rod to see if we can try and fish ourselves a saddle. Um, so far, we've fished a lot and we haven't really found anything useful. I'm probably best off waiting for it to rain. Because when it rains, it improves your chances. Now, Law 3 and Unbreak, Law 3 and Luck 3 are the best things you can get. And as you guys can see, we keep getting fish. We're not getting anything exciting, just the fish. So, what have I got in here? We're going to take ourselves one, two, three. Let's take 10 of these. Okay, we're gonna need to grab ourselves some more stuff. And actually, I'm also gonna cook my stuff too, because I've got some extra stuff that we can cook. We're gonna cook the fish. Again, food is really important on realms, because it goes down extremely fast. So, one, two. I'm gonna cook the salmon. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna cook them. Uh, food, okay, we need to take off food. Where's the food? That's not food echo. Food's in here, so we're gonna have to grab ourselves carrots. So let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's take two of these, but we're going to obviously get ourselves some more. So we have some carrots. We got ourselves some good stuff. This is good. I want to try and find myself some more chickens, though, because chickens are a good source of food. Plus, I like chickens anyway. They're pretty cool. Um, anything else that we need inside of here? We haven't really got anything exciting that we need that I know of. Um, actually, one, two, three, four, five, six. We can put them in our ore store. We are selling obsidian. Now, Dallas did buy my emeralds, my diamonds, and some of my iron. So we are going to have to stock that up very, very soon. Uh, but like I said, first, let's sleep. Let's sleep away the night, the night time. It's always sleep time. It's always sleep time in the series. Let's sleep. I'm going to grab my wheat farm, hopefully find myself some animals, and then we can start to do a little bit more, more fun things. All right? More fun things. I think I'm really liking the idea of a stone store, though. I think it's really, really good idea. So the farm is finally growing now. Thankfully that we changed the light source in here. Things are starting to grow, which I like. So let's just quickly take the wheat farm. 
I'm not going to be making any bread right now, so don't worry about that. I'm just going to simply use the wheat for the animals, um, the sheep and the cows, because obviously we're going to need to breed them. The more animals we have, the less we'll be worrying about food. I'm also going to take the potatoes as well. This is something that I can actually cook. Potatoes are always a good source of food. All right, so I really want to try and get myself a horse. We need a saddle. I need to fish for a saddle. If I'm lucky enough, we might come across a mine shaft and find one. Um, but we're really not being that lucky when it comes to doing, like, searching for animal no, animals, um, for caves and stuff. We haven't been really spending that much time looking for them. So, potato and seeds. Okay, so we're going to go across here. Whatever seeds I have left over, we can use these for the chickens. Hopefully, one of these, um... Chicken eggs. Hopefully these one of chicken eggs will produce a chicken. And then we can start to get more eggs and then we can end up with more chickens. And then it'll be like a an endless cycle. So that's the wheat farm. Potatoes again. All right, these can go down. Let's just, just plant these all down over here. Uh, one, two. I'm still getting used to the split touch as well. All right. And when 0 0.16 is out, we can do a race for the wither. I think the wither would be a really fun thing to do as well. So we've got ourselves quite a lot of this. This is good. This is good. This is good. We've got ourselves... Oh my God, how much have we got? There. 29. 29 spare. Let's cook these. We're cooking a lot of our food right now. Don't ask me why. Again, I'm probably gonna have to... Are they, are they cooked? They are to take these. Wait, how many did we end up with? 49? Alright, then we'll take this. We've got lots of food. Alright, what have I got in my, you know, seeds? That's fine. Oh yeah, we, we did get ourselves a lily pad when we did a little bit of fishing. We could use the slime ball block for something. This is kind of like my poop chest, so things I don't really need on me right now. So things I don't really need now, I don't need any string, that can go in there. Don't really need a crafting table. Clownfish, don't need you. Gunpowder, I should probably put that in the room, but oh well. Again, we need to get our animals going. So, we're gonna try and hope that we're lucky. Okay, so the things that we're gonna need here is, I'm gonna put my food here to start off with, and we're gonna put the potatoes there. Then we're gonna grab my this, we're gonna grab ourselves this, I'm gonna grab myself the carrots, and we're gonna go and try and find ourselves some animals. Okay, and I'm actually gonna switch this out for the seeds. So we need as many animals as we can get. Maybe we'll come across some chickens. Whatever animal we come across first, there's a pig over there. So let's lock down a pig straight away, okay? Let's get our first animal, and it's gonna be Reuben. So let's do this, let's, let's lock Reuben away. Hopefully he, does he see me? Do you see me, Reuben? Do you see me? Hello, Reuben? Do you see me? Where did he, where did he, where did he go? Is he in here already? Ruben? He just, he disappeared. All right, well, I'm gonna open this because we're gonna, he literally disappeared, but we lost us. Oh, it was a magic pig, he disappeared. Well, I see myself a sheep over here, so we'll take you. Oh, and there's a cow. So in fact, we'll take both of them. Hello, and you too, come to me. Come to me, Mr. Cow. In fact, I'm gonna have to, no, I'm gonna have to kill him. Let's get rid of you real quick before you end up killing me. Let's get rid of you, right, come on, you. Yes, sheep, follow me, there's a pig down there. There's a cow down here, which means we're now going to have ourselves two animals already. The only thing is, we need... I want to try and get at least two of each one. So I want two sheep, two cows, two pigs, two chickens. Come on. Let's go, little friend. Let's take you. Let us go. I know you guys like this, so let's go. Let's take you in. Taking you home. Alright, these are the first animals we've got. This, this way. This way. Come on. Stop dancing. Here we go. Stop being so silly now. Inside. Hello, come on, come on Mr. Cow, get your booty in here, I know you can see me, okay, cow is in here, alright, so let's lock this down, come on Mr. Sheep, I see you there, I know you see me, they, they seem to like a lot, they, like, they seem to like to dance a lot, alright, so there's our first animals obtained, come on Mr. Sheep, there you go, alright, I'll come back for you, first thing I'm going to do here is one and two, Okay, we wasn't that lucky. We need chickens. We're not gonna... Chickens can be a little bit harder to find, but we need to try and find ourselves some more animals. So we finished the bridge. The bridge is now done. Bridge is looking good, by the way. Now, animals seem to be spawning around here a lot, so I'm gonna have a little bit of a look around here. We wanna try and grab ourselves some more pigs. Is that a pig? Oh, it's a pig, Ribbon. Let's go, follow me. Here we go, let's take you. Okay, so we've got ourselves one pig. This is good, this is happening very, very fast. <laughs> Too fast for us to count. Let's go put these inside, so. Got ourselves. Um, oh yeah, by the way guys, we might make ourselves like a, I forgot to tell you, I forgot to mention. In this, we might make like an under, underground base for the, um, for the, like, we might go underground, make an extra large room type of thing. So, let's put you in here. Mm. Come on, Mr. Ruben, you're dancing too, are you? Come on, Mr. Ruben, I see you there. Come on, there you go. Alright, he's in too. Okay. 
There's a couple of animals. Now, I will eventually put some carpets on there so I can just jump straight over. They really seem to be really, really happy. Let's go and have a little bit of a look for some more animals. There's normally some more down here, too. So maybe there's another cow down here. There is a cow down here. And actually, there's a sheep, too. Come on, Mesto. Let's go. We need eggs. So we're going to have to do a little bit of a looking for chickens. Come on, up. Up we go, Mr. Mr. Sheep. You can make this. I believe in you. We can now breed them. So this, the breeding has started. Come on. Please, Mr. Sheep. I see you. I know you're there. Do I have to help you up? How are you going to get off? This way. Mm. Come on. Stop making life so difficult for yourself. All right, he's made it. He figured his way out. There we go. They're learning. Okay, so we've got an extra cow and got ourselves a sheep too. So let's bring you inside. Come on, Mr. Fellows. Let's go. Let's bring you inside. Come on. I see you. Don't play, don't play mm. dumb. Okay. Right. Mm. Come on. Here we go. They should make it in. They should make it in. Come on, Mr. Sheep. Fight your way in. Both of you guys can fight your way in. Let's go and stand over here. I probably should have made this a little bit bigger, but uh, right now it's kind of not happening. Come on. Come on. Sheep. Yes. No. Quick. It's a race between who's going to get it first. Come on, sheep. All right, then. Let's change this real quick. Surely you've seen me. Come on. Yes. Okay, they're both in. Okay, they're both in. They're both in. They're both in. They're both in. They both made it. Okay, let's um, let's get out of here. And let's breed you. Breed you. Breed you. And last but not least, breed you. Okay, so now we've got ourselves some baby animals. This is good. I like this. We need an extra pig. And we can find some chickens. We'll take them as well. Now, the problem is I've not really seen many chickens. So, but look, we might try and find ourselves an extra pig. The pig will be a bonus because that means we've got all the animals twice. Now, sometimes they do disappear, but I'm going to have a little bit of a look down here because if we're lucky, we will come across some chickens. I just haven't seen any chickens anywhere. I don't know if anyone's got any animals. We've got ourselves a horsey, but we don't really need any horsies because, I mean, it's an animal shelter, but I want to make myself my own horse shelter eventually. Um, so let's just have a, wait, is that a chicken? <gasps> it's not a chicken. What's this? Who's, this? Who's been building here? Someone's been building here. Someone's been busy. Someone's been very, very busy in this series. Okay, then, well, let's, uh, come on, chickens. That's a creeper. You're not a pet. I don't need you. There's two creepers, actually. I don't need any of them. Okay, this is probably a, a dangerous place to be. Again, more horses and there's a zombie. Okay, let's go to the other side. Let's go to the other side and see what's going on over there because we're not finding any animals over here. All right. They seem to be around by the water a lot as well. So come on, Mr. Chicken. So we need, we need to try and find some chicken eggs. Don't know who's got the chickens, but um, I wouldn't mind myself some chicken eggs. The thrift shop didn't treat us very, very well. That's the only downside to this. They didn't treat us very, 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 very well. Okay, well, let's try and find ourselves a pig anyway. Now, the thing is, right, I can show you guys something. I don't know who this is. I don't know if it's Dallas or I don't know if it's Jack. But there is chickens around here. There is some chickens al alive. And they sit in the pot. They sit in the pot the whole entire time. They just they just sit here. But they're not dropping any eggs. Like this guy, I don't know if this guy owns, I don't know if he owns him, but like, he's kind of stuck. Like, maybe I can feed you and feed you. And maybe we'll end up with a baby chicken, if we're lucky. Like, can we end up with a baby chicken, please? No? No baby chicken? They're just there. And I can't steal them. Because they're not mine. And they're not dropping any eggs. Or are they? Or are you dropping any eggs? He can't move because he's kind of trapped in there. But no eggs. No, So far, no eggs. Okay, we need to try and find our, ourselves some own chickens. I was just feeding them chickens because I don't think they've ever been fed any... Oh, there's a Reuben. Let's take him. Take the Reuben with me. Okay, this is good. So we might have to wait for chickens... And try and buy some eggs from somebody. Come on, Mr. Ruben. I see you there. Why? Why? The, the, come on. Here we go. He sees me too. All right. So chickens. What chicken? What what biome did chickens spawn in? A good biome to go to is probably a swamp biome. They seem to like swamp biomes a lot. Come on. Come on. Let's take you. All right. So, so far, so good out of the animals. I'm liking this. It's really, really good. There's another sheep over there. We don't need any more sheep. I only need this, uh, this piggy. Come on, Mr. Ruben. Let's take you home. You now belong to me. And eventually, we could end up selling the animals. We could do. All right? We could end up selling them. Don't know who's going to buy animals, but we could sell them. OK, 
Come on, Reuben. All right, it's becoming nighttime, so this is the perfect timing for me. All right, let's roll. Quick. Before nighttime. So, the only thing we're missing now is chickens. Hopefully we end up with some eggs very, 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 very soon, because then we can complete it. And then we can continue to breed and take over the world. Come on, Reuben. He seems to be a good little sausage. Oops, he's not a sausage. It's bacon. Shh, I'm not gonna say that. Come on, come on, quick, quick. This way. Why are you so excited? Everyone seems to be getting stuck there. Quickly, Ruben. He's in, he's in, he's in, he's in. Okay, uh, let's close it. Let's feed you. Feed and... And... Feed! Okay, so now we got ourselves some animals. This is good. Animals are breeding. This is really, really good. So, like I said, the next thing we're gonna end up doing is, we need to grab our, in fact, I wanna make myself a little bit of a, can I make a sign? Do I have enough to make a sign? For some reason I made myself a carrot on a stick. Okay then, well I didn't mean to do that. Um, <laughs> I should probably make some hair bells actually. So let's make two of these. And let's put these inside of here. For now. They can go inside there. Um, things I don't really need to be carrying with me right now. Well, I don't need the carrot on the stick. I didn't mean to make that. That can go in there. Wait, did it use my enchanted fishing rod to do that? Oh, I think it did. I think it changed my enchanted fishing rod into that. That was a very, very bad mistake. Oh, go away. Go away. I think I just wasted my enchantments. No, I made a mistake. That's a really big mistake. That's me being a noob. Oh, can't believe that just happened. Okay, well, this can go in here. Um... These can go in here. The carrot and the stick can go in there. Okay, they're gonna be the breeding things. I can't believe I just made that mistake. I just changed my enchanted fishing rod into a carrot and a stick. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode. Hopefully you're having a great Sunday. Give me some ideas on what we could build in the comment section. And maybe you'll be on the wall next week. Take care, stay beautiful, and I'll catch you very soon. Bye!